I will share with you the Odyssey of the cheese. I did not pick up the cheese today. I had it, then it went warm, and then I put it back under ice. So this is what happened. The cheese went from white to yellowish when it went warm. Now it doesn't frighten me, but I will check on it. I do not know what this cheese is. I've been wanting to try it out. No, ever since I got it. So, how is it tasting? See, if fish would get warm, or chicken, or any meat, I would not eat it, of course not. Needless to say. It looks perfect, it smells good. It really smells good. It's really yummy. So this cheese is very creamy. Creamy. Le creme. And it reminds me a little bit of the triangles I got when I was a child. They came in some round containers. A lot of these were like triangle cream cheese. Not a good quality cheese. I'm not saying this is not. It's super salty. And it is flavorful. I don't think it's good for children but it's not very strong together this cheese has been here for days with me and it did not have much refrigeration in my container i cooled it down since yesterday but it had been like two days without any so let's see how this works we had this cheese before i want to share with you and did the package kept close I will reiterate, a cheese usually in Europe, France, Germany, it's, it's not stored in the fridge. It's stored under a key cheese bell, Kieseglocke. It's just, just a board and with a little um, lid on a gas lid usually on top. Together with all the other cheeses. No, it needs to be accommodated, yes. Let's take this off. So it looks good. Now, it looked, uh, that lot in the beginning looked just the same when I had it in the beginning. See, there's no, nothing wrong with this. There's no fungus. <laughs> Even if there would, it would not be a thing. Look. Now we try it right here on camera. <laughs> It's perfect. It's just the way it was when I had it the first time. So it works well. <laughs> just for you to notice. We have com I have commented on this cheese some days ago, which I said this would be good with pairing with whatever I said. So I wouldn't know which one it is. It's a, okay, I can't talk to you about it. It's a manchego, which doesn't taste like manchego at all. Because manchego tastes like gouda. It's in Mexico at least. And this is more like a raw sheep's milk cheese, so that already has a different taste. It's it's very yeah artisanal. It's flavorful, but it's also mild. And but it has character and personality. And that's what this is. So if you're a cheese lover, you might wanna dig into it. Hi, <laughs> Princess Luca. Ciao. Can't go. So I told you it wasn't my favorite cheese when I had it a few times. But this is definitely a gourmet cheese. And this one is not. So if I had to choose, I don't want to keep the cheese more long, longer. I'm going to have a little bit and then that's done. I also notice now that I get more other different foods, I don't need to back up with cheese. And I'm also getting to know how, how the food can store. Well, if I have to continue doing this, like wait in a few days. So in terms of which one, definitely this one. I'm not going to have more of this. That no, was nice. <laughs> Bye. Oh, I'm not really, really sure if I really must comment on this. But what am I showing you? See, even if I get shit, I'm calm and <laughs> composed. I'm going to take a little bit of water out of my container. And wash my hands and sprinkle it over. There. I have my water container right here. You know that. <laughs> See, I'm living in a shithole in many ways. And I don't make a fuss. 
I intend to appreciate, which I actually do. I do not actually intend. I appreciate because, man, from not food, that, it's just wonderful. Do you understand? <laughs> That's how I am positive. No, there's plenty of things I could complain about. Why would I? But I'm not the type. It's like, doesn't suit me well because complaining is not really what fits into my, into my vibration. <laughs> Because it feels bad, if it's hurting me, I don't need to. So I'll spend a tremendous amount of time feeling bad so the people who complain and whine and shit can walk around and show me how they shit and whine and then I'm gonna go off. Ciao, you guys, my people. Together. Yes. <laughs>